Is that low enough? Okay, go ahead. So in order to do um, your incised lines in your bottom of your project, you need to make your name incised or push down into the clay with your ball skip, uh, ball tipped sculpting tool, okay? And you wanna make it le legible where I can read it so that I know it's yours. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the tool and you're gonna lightly press your initials into the bottom of the clay, however you want them to be. It's kind of like your artist signature in clay. So you don't wanna just scratch it on there, okay? Give it some kind of a design or style, all right? So I lightly press the initials into the bottom of the clay. Can everybody see that? Okay. Then in order to incise it or push it down in so that once we glaze it, it doesn't just fill in with glaze, we need to take the smaller end of the tool and press in deeper. So do you see how the line gets deeper into the clay? You can see this first side of the M a lot better, okay? And there are these little tiny pieces of clay that you're gonna have to pull out of there because you're incising or you're pushing some of that clay away down in. So you just have to remove those little pieces. There's really no specific name for those. They're just kind of little annoying pieces that we have to just keep digging and removing out of there until you get it to look nice and neat. You just take your finger and kind of brush those away, okay? Also, since you're in second period, what do you need to put on the bottom of your projects? Two. A two. And you can incorporate it right into your design. It doesn't have to be large. Just make sure that we can tell your initials in a two. Now, this is not my project, but I have my initials, bless you. I have my initials incised into the bottom of this now. If I don't like the design that I made, what can I do to make it go away? Press it. I can just take my finger and smooth over it again and it'll disappear, okay? Does anybody have any questions about how to make incised lines? Okay, then I want you to get your ball tip sculpting tool and get your initials incised in the bottom of your